Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Now, we had Suzuki South Africa, the head offices. As you can see, a lot of cool motorbikes and all of that because that's what Suzuki does, kind of. But Suzuki is also famous for doing a lot of good things, good deeds, good making motorcycling better. I mean, they've got their training, uh, safety training exercises and all kinds of things that they invest in, doing a lot of help. But not just in motorcycling, Suzuki is heavily involved with Can Survive, which is a group trying to raise awareness for cancer and uh, hopefully try and sort of curb uh, cancer. And let's just say for this show in particular, it's, it's given recent things that have happened, it, it, yeah, it's kind of close to home. Yeah, 100% um, Don. You know, the number one thing with Can Survive is early detection saves lives. And that's it. And the whole point of what we do on the flagship ride is literally go to community centers, go to schools and that, and talk to people about cancer. It's not a death sentence, you know. Mm. It's... You, you talk about it, you can learn about it, and the amount of people that come forward that don't realize either if they've got cancer, someone in their family's got cancer, you know, it, it, it really is early detection saves lives. The yeah. more you talk about it, you can go see a doctor earlier, you can come up with these things, and it's not taboo to talk about cancer. Yeah. No, it's becoming even more and more important. I mean, it's, it's mm. yeah, the big C, as they call it these days. Now, all right, so it wasn't just, uh, it's not just we're standing in an office talking about cancer. It was, as you said, a ride. I mean, tell us about the whole Cancer Survive initiative and everything. Yeah, so this year is our second year doing the uh, Cancer Survive flagship ride. Last year we were in the Western Cape. This year we were in the Royal Buffalo King area, which was rather interesting. Yeah. Um, if I'm completely honest, we, we quickly say, let's shoot down to Sun City for the weekend and we ride to the Royal Buffalo King, but we don't really understand what's going on there. And it was more of an education this time for ourselves as can survivor team and riders and supporters etc because the population there i think there was a stat something like 0.1 percent know about cancer or talk about cancer there yeah and it was interesting to see after doing the edu shows and chatting to the people in the shows how many people came forward so it might have been a smaller penetrate a smaller area than mm. last year but our penetration was that much bigger you know we yeah. got through to more people yeah and it is okay so just to kind of simplify it even further so you guys a whole bunch of you the can survive people it's, it's it's from what i can see it's people organizing this it's people who are survivors of cancer yeah a whole lot of people you all got on motorbikes and suzuki cars so it's and quite a it, it's it's quite a big machine if you want yeah. to put it that way we've got cancer survivors that uh, will ride motorcycles as well as being the suzuki um, automobiles as backup yeah. we've got supporters who raise funds and everything to join on the ride then we've also got entertainers we've got th there's so many moving parts logistical yeah. team that goes to each yeah. place and sets up and you know the bikes are just a part of it yeah. it's a nice talking piece you go to a school and people oh there's motorbikes here oh yeah. this is so cool we're really hyping and this them bike all is up. so cool it's this is by the way yeah, yeah. We're so we hyping them they yeah. hyping up the people and then we have our show okay. so we're not just getting there and the people saying oh we're going to talk cancer now and then they because if you put up scared. a bulletin board say by the way come to this place to talk about cancer we come to yeah. this place there's cool motorbikes great stuff it's happening. a it's a vibe oh, you know there's a lot it. going on there's singers there's drums, there's go, and people start becoming part of yeah. the show, which is very important as well. Yeah, you make learning about cancer fun. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> what exactly it is. It. It's yeah. exactly what it is. We do exactly okay. that, and again, it's it's not a taboo. Yeah, you must talk no, about you're it. Right. So we unfortunately didn't go with the whole thing. You know, we'll talk about that next year. We'll have a meeting soon. <laughs> um, but we did go. To, we did actually. We were actually at the finish where all you guys mm. who came along. It was in Pretoria. And something I noticed, I mean, everybody sort of arrived. Now, we were sort of just kind of arrived just, to the, just at the finish, saw everyone arrive. And clearly, clearly it would meant a lot to a lot of people because the amount of sort of emotion among the people who were part of Cancer yeah. Live, you know, who were helping out with it. And all the people stopped and it was like, wow. We, you know, you can see these people mm. are like, wow, we've done it. We've done something. There was it's, connections. It, it is a very emotional trip. Yeah. Um, there's a lot going on. You... It's, it's a week of, you can be crying now, you can be the toughest oak later. There's just so much going on. And as a team, to know that we've gone there and done something. I say we, our Suzuki team, we are part of the Cancer Vibe team. Yeah. You know, we in it, we breathe it, we sleep it for that week. And yeah. so much so that our Suzuki partnership with Cancer Vibe has been extended. We Brilliant. extended it from October now, yeah. um, right through to October next year. 
yeah. um, in the sense that we've given them a Jimny five door to get around to do their daily wow. work. We've given them a Tiga as well to get around and do what they need to do. So yeah. our These journey are all cars, by the way. Yeah, yeah. For the biking <laughs> people, so they go, wait, what? They're called cars. So we've, you know? we've given them vehicles, <laughs> you know, yeah. um, to get along and get out there to do what they need to do. Yeah. You know, they go and give people hope and everything. But yeah. how they get there, we move the people and they go and give hope. And that's, that's, that's the important part as well. That's fantastic. And as you say, it is important people know about it. So they know to mm. kind of get checked, they know to look, they know to do it. 100%. And hey, motorbikes cool also at the same time. Well, that, that's exactly yeah. it. It's, it's, it's a bunch yeah. of people that want yeah. to go and spread hope, but love riding motorcycles. Yeah. And we, we piggyback so on that a bit, but it's turned out to be we're family now, you know. Yeah, it's not fantastic. just a matter of here's our bikes and off you go. So anybody else who wants to sort of learn more about Can Survive, who wants to maybe take part in some way, or I don't know what the options mm. are, I presume there's a website and all that. Yeah, so you can go into the Can Survive website. Yes. Um, they've got quite a, a strict application policy, if you want to say that, if yeah. you want to become a supporter, or if you are a cancer survivor and you want to join the team, you go on there, you go through a couple of interviews and everything like that, because it's not just the flagship ride that you're part mm. of. Once you've joined Can Survive, there's weekend events, is you know weekday events and all these kind of things and to be part of yeah. it is quite moving and we're currently looking now as well at the same time is we want to get more people to ride with us in the okay. cancer life. so there's something coming in the future <laughs> but yeah we do. riding motorbikes and doing good stuff it just sounds like heaven doesn't it <laughs> so there we are ladies and gentlemen as i say suzuki doing really good work uh, particularly with can survive um to Carl, you know, and all the, everybody was there. Congratulations. And go and have a look at it. And uh, yeah, we look forward to next year. And, and Don, I must admit, it's yeah. not just Suzuki Motorcycles. It's Suzuki as a brand. Yeah. You know, we've, we, as a brand, we're doing it all together. So as it's I say, us, they did, yeah. They did bikes, they did cars. I mean, if we were doing river, they would probably put in boats. 100%, or you know, <laughs> you if, know if, we, if we were able to have a big dam, we, I promise you we'll have the we'll cancer survivors on, the, on a boat with, <laughs> with our Suzuki Marines there yeah. and, and off we go. But so as a go. brand, that's what we do. So there we go, not just making good motorbikes, doing great things also. So there we go, Carl, again, thank you so much. And, Thanks, uh, Don. We look forward to hearing what you're gonna do next. Take, ride, repeat.